Good morning friends. Welcome to Dr. Sadiq Mathematics channel. Please, please subscribe this channel, like this video, share this video friends. In this lecture, I am going to solve problem on surface integral. Let us see the problem friends. If f bar that is equal to 4xz i bar minus y square j bar plus yz k bar. That means a given vector point function. Evaluate integral over s f bar dot n bar ds. That means it is double integration where yes this s is the surface of the cube bounded by bounded by x is equal to 0, y is equal to 0, z is equal to 0, x is equal to a, y is equal to a, z is equal to a. Given surface friends, cube, cube, say draw the cube, say this is uh, x axis, y axis and z axis. Okay. He given x is equal to 0, x is equal to a. Say x is equal to 0, x is equal to a. Say so draw the cube friends. So this is x is equal to a. This one friends y is equal to a. And this one z is equal to a. z is equal to a. How many surfaces friends here? Six surfaces. That means six faces. Say this is S1. The opposite face surface is S2. And this surface is S3. Opposite one is S4. At x is equal to A is S5. Uh, back side is S6. X is. Here, the order of the surfaces is very, very important, friends. The order of the surfaces is very, very important. Because to evaluate this integration easily, easily. So, the order is, once again, take S1 here. The opposite surface is S2. At y is equal to A, say S3. Opposite surface is S4. At x is equal to A, S5. Opposite surface is S6. Opposite surface is S6. We can easily remember the order, friends. See, our surfaces at say s1 is z is equal to a s3 is at y is equal to a and s5 is equal to x is equal to a you remember in this way friends in this way now let us see the solution solution write double integration say surface integration integral of s f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to that is equal to integral over s1 f bar dot n bar ds plus integral s2 f bar dot n bar ds plus integral s3 f bar dot n bar ds plus integral s4 f bar dot n bar ds plus integral s5 f bar dot n bar ds plus integral s6 f bar dot n bar ds say so this is 1 that means you find integral s1 s2 s3 s4 s5 s6 and add them add them then you get integral s f bar dot n bar ds okay friends before going to the find the integral s1 f bar dot n bar ds value write given data given f bar friends f bar that is equal to 4 x z i minus y square j plus y z k ok what is n bar n bar that is equal to outward outward unit normal vector outward unit normal vector ok now take integral over s1 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to that is equal to where is s1 friends here 
now you take projection on xy plane friends take projection of s1 on xy plane xy plane so this s1 here double integral what is our region now xy plane friends so say r1 r1 f bar dot f bar dot n bar for this surface for this surface what is outward unit normal vector outward unit normal vector here along the z we know it is k bar k bar so dot k bar now ds ds means we are taking in xy plane so dx dy dx dy so that is equal to that is equal to integral double integral we know x limits and y limits what is the x limits here x is equal to 0 to a y limits 0 to a so 0 to a 0 to a f bar dot k bar we know i bar dot k bar j bar k bar values 0 so k bar dot k bar is 1 so we get here y z dx dy that is equal to here z value friends z value a z value is a so a a see here we have only y so we can take integral of dx integral of dx is x 0 to a and integral of y y square by 2 y square by 2 between 0 to a so that is equal to that is equal to a such upper limit a lower limit the value 0 such upper limit a square by 2 lower limit the value 0 so that is equal we get here a power 4 by 2 a power 4 by 2 now take second one integral over s2 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to now yeah, where is s2 friends in the xy plane in the xy plane so outward unit normal vector here previously we have k bar now this time minus k bar minus k bar so same integral double integral over r2 f bar dot this time we get minus k bar into dx dy that is equal to now if you observe here f bar at k bar value yz friends yz in the xy plane in the xy plane what is z value friends zero so this value is zero since z is equal to zero in xy plane xy plane now the third one third one integral over s3 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to s3 friends s3 for this surface what is outward unit term vector j bar along y it is j bar so take projection same friends take projection on xz plane xz plane so i want to write directly friends here integral over integral f bar dot j bar j bar dx dz dx dz so we can write r3 but we know xz limits friends x is equal 0 to a z limits 0 to a so 0 to a 0 to a so that is equal to f bar dot j bar minus y square minus y square so minus y square y value friends a y value is a so minus a square minus a square now take integral there are all the terms are constant friends so we can write here integral of dx is x between 0 to a integral of dz is z 0 to a so that is equal to minus a square such so upper limit we get a lower limit value 0 here upper, upper limit a lower limit value 0 so finally get here minus a power 4 minus a power 4 now take fourth integration friends fourth integration integral of s4 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to that is equal to see, see friends s4 what is outward this is outward previously we get j bar now this time minus 
j bar minus j bar so double integral over say this is r4 r4 f bar dot minus j bar dx dz dx dz say friends this is xz plane in the xz plane what is y value y value is 0 y value is 0 see friends f bar dot j bar value f bar dot j bar value okay we get uh, y we get y in xz plane y value 0 in xz plane y value 0 so this value is 0 this value is 0 right now take integral over s5 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to integral double integral s5 friends now this time you take the projection on y z plane y z plane so we know y limits and z limits y limits are 0 to a z limits also 0 to a f bar dot f bar dot what is outward i bar what is outward i bar so we get here f bar dot i bar dx dy dx dy now f bar dot i bar for xz so that is equal to integral 0 to a integral 0 to a we get 4 xz okay for x what is x value friends here x value is a so a z into dx dy dx dy sorry friends this is uh, dy dz this is dy and this is dz dy dz dz okay that is equal to 4a is constant we can integrate separately friends because independent so integral of dy is y between 0 to a integral of uh, z is z square by 2 between 0 to a so that is equal to 4a so stop we get a okay uh, a here lower limit the value is 0 here a square by 2 lower limit the value is 0 so finally we get here 2 times uh, 2 a power 4 2 a power 4 so integral of s 6 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to we know f bar dot n bar value friends f bar dot i bar what we get here what we get here 4 xz okay 4 xz in yz plane in yz plane x value friends 0 so this value is 0 because x is equal to 0 x is equal to 0 in yz plane yz plane therefore substitute substitute in in 1 in 1 so we get integral yes f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to s1 friends a power 4 by 2 a power 4 by 2 s2 value 0 s3 value minus a power 4 minus a power 4 plus s4 value 0 s5 s5 to a power 4 s6 value 0 so that is equal to a power 4 by 2 plus 2a power 4 minus a power 4 we get a power 4 finally get here the lcm is 2 minus 2a power 4 plus a power 4 3a power 4 which is the required solution of required solution of given problem one second friends one second he given a cube okay in the cube the important point is remember the surface order what friends surface order so s1 s2 s3 s4 s5 s6 okay now we get uh, double integration becomes here integral of s1 plus s2 plus s3 plus s4 plus s5 plus s6 s6 take first one okay uh, the integral of s1 f bar dot n bar ds that is equal to double integral of r1 f bar dot 
n bar is outward unit term vector so outward unit term vector is k bar so the k bar dx dy simply apply the formulas we get here f over 4 by 2 integral over s2 f bar dot n bar ds okay friends here here it is xy plane z value is 0 so z value is 0 okay so the integration value is 0 we we'll take s3 okay in s3 also we get here s3 what is outward outward unit number of j bar so we write j bar in place of n bar it is xz plane okay it is xz plane apply the values uh, simplify it then we get minus a power 4 similarly s power 4 s power 5 sorry s4 s5 s6 okay we add them then we get the required integral value integral value hope you understand friends thank you thank you for watching this video jai hind